almost at a thousand subs here, and today I'm going to show you how to install the 4GB patcher variant for New Vegas, as well as NVSE. This was a viewer request. So first off, head to the Nexus page, links will be in the description as always, and skedaddle over here and click manual download. And you have to sign in. For NVSE, go to download stable version from this link, and then make a bird sound. Close it, you don't need it. Open your file manager and go to downloads. You won't have extreme JPEG, I'm sorry. See, I've already downloaded this, so destroy it. And now you have these two files. They're both 7-zip files, which means you need 7-zip or WinRAR or whatever decompression tool you would like. I use 7-zip. So, I'll do extract files. Okay. And there you go. You can delete these, you will never need them again in your entire life. So first off, we're going to do NVSE. So, oops, go in here and you'll see this absolute garbage. Data, source, a DLL, a DLL, a DLL, an EXE, a text file, a DLL, and a text file. Highlight all this, get rid of the text file, get rid of the text file, you don't need them. You don't necessarily need source, because source is for those who are making mods, but it's good to have it anyway, and, well doesn't matter much. So go to New Vegas directory. In this case it's my D drive, program files x86, Steam, Steam apps, common, and then Fallout New Vegas. And you'll see this is the directory and just do, oops, do paste. And you can say, oh no, we have these files already, you absolute idiot. And hit replace. This is what you do if you're updating NVSE. And now that you have NVSE in your game, Head back to downloads. You can da you can uh, delete this, and now go back to the uh, four gig patcher file. Here's the four gig patch exe, and here's the source. So there's the there's the CPP file. Sadly, it's not CCCP. Now it's not a communist file. And copy this. Give it a good old copy, and then do the exact same thing. Go to New Vegas directory, program files x86, Steam, Steam apps common and then head over to New Vegas paste that in your main directory and it says you already have this you absolute moron and hit replace and if you're doing this for the first time it wouldn't tell you that because you don't have it now run it as administrator and it says NVS NV patch exe and it says the patch is already patched. I'm sorry, New Vegas is already patched. I'm sorry you can't patch a patch. And press the key to continue, so I'll press W. If you haven't run it before, it'll say patching done, and then you press the key and then it's, that's it, it's done. If you want to run your game through Steam, for whatever reason, now do this. Go to your documents, and go to my games, go to Fallout New Vegas, and you'll see these INIs. You'll see Prefs INI and Fallout INI. Right click on it, go to properties, and check read only, and hit OK. Do that for the follow INI, the follow prefs INI, and then go over to your game directory once more, and do the exact same to the follow default INI. So right there. In this case, I don't run it through Steam, I run it through a shortcut. So, I have no use for running it through Steam. The reason this is done is because when you launch the Steam launcher of New Vegas, it has a tendency to scramble your INIs. So if you have custom INIs like mine are, if you have a bunch of weird things going on, like a heavily modded game, doing so will usually screw you up. So, to save yourself some headache, you can do that. And that's, that's about it. I intend to do some streams in New California because I'm on spring break and I'm really sorry I haven't been able to put anything up lately. I read all the comments, I watch the sub count, I do your dishes for you. I'm paying attention so don't think I have don't think I faded away and I don't care. I do care. I love you. So I'll try and get some things done this week and hopefully it works out. So if you need a uh, help with any of this, call me an idiot in the comment section and post your problem. The previous tutorials have found some very interesting random issues I've never heard of, so most of which I can fix. For 99.9% .9 of you this will work.
there are some weird fringe cases where some things don't work. So, hopefully this helped, and have a good one.